Jim Mooney with the Nature Conservancy here at Gilbert Stewart Birthplace and Museum in North Kingstown, Rhode Island. It's the home to a lot of history and one of the most productive herring runs in southern New England. We just finished a really cool project to make this run even stronger. And to tell us more about it, we're going to talk to one of the real experts, Brian Sikowski with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. A fish passage engineer, I'm, I'm typically designing fishways to move fish up or down over a barrier. In this case, we needed to prevent fish from moving upstream. There's no trap. It, it's just uh, five panels of grating with a half inch spacing. That half inch spacing is critical to make sure that the fish can't nose through that or, or squeeze through that. When, when river herring get to this fork in the river, and if some do decide to come up this way, they will not be able to, to go upstream of this point. The intent is to prevent any fish from getting uh, stranded and, and, and dying at the base of Gilbert Stewart Dam. 